Hey, what's up everybody? It's TJ with Sanctified Homes. And today I just real quick wanted to talk about when we're making recommendations for certain types of products, let's say WeatherLogic or Rockwool or a certain type of caulk or siding or any of that. If you guys are wondering how that is installed outside of maybe some of the little tips that we give, you can always go on the manufacturer's website and that website is going to tell you how it should be installed. So if you guys are building anywhere else in the country, one, know your climate zone, and then two, you can look on the manufacturer's website and it will say, here's how to install our product, right? So there's things you can install. Builders can say, well, this is the way we do it. Whatever it is, I am telling you, follow how the manufacturer says to do it and you will be covered by if they have some type of warranty on that product. I'm seeing lots of stuff out there where people are spending the extra money to buy, let's say Rockwool or WeatherLogic or a zip type sheeting from, it's very similar to WeatherLogic that we use, right? But then I'm seeing it not installed properly. People are cutting through it with holes and not, not air sealing the holes properly and wondering why their blower door scores are really low. Uh, same thing, you'll have cold spots in your walls if you're not actually, if you're not following up on your framers to make sure they're doing 16 on center studs for that friction fit for your rock wool or whatever type of product you're using, right? So we recommend a lot of different caulks. So we really like Sashco. Well, you can't take the Sashco flex mortar and put it around your tub, right? Just because we say that we like that stuff. You need to use the right stuff in the right place and then also use it to the manufacturer specs. So if you're staining a deck and it says, do not stain unless it's between 50 and 70, that's when you should do it, okay? So if your builder is not following those guidelines or you're wondering, yes, you can ask all the Facebook communities and whatnot, but check the manufacturer specs for how they recommend and say it should be installed. And you guys will be in a much better position, more informed, than just asking Facebook communities or asking some other builder, go look at what those specs are and that will help you be better informed. So again, this is just a quick little builder tip for you so you guys can understand what you're getting, what you're putting in, and then also making sure when you're spending more money on these better products, you're getting what you expect. So if you have any more questions about this stuff, please reach out, ask us, make sure you're hitting like, subscribe, share the channel, it helps us a ton. And in the meantime, don't forget to raise your standard. We'll talk to you guys soon.